Hello everyone. In previous video, we saw 15 awesome JavaScript one-liners. If you haven't watched that, please visit that video. It will be fun. In this video, we will see Hover CSS pseudo class. So the Hover pseudo class in CSS selects elements when the mouse cursor is current over them. It's commonly associated with and anchor elements. So when a link like this is hovered, the hover class is getting applied. Let's see with an example. Let's say we have an anchor tag with href or youtube.com and some text. Okay, so let's see. This is an anchor tag. So if you want to select this anchor tag when it is hovered, you can write down anchor over x decoration underline color red, for example, to see if it is getting applied. Yes. So when you hover the anchor tag, here you can check, click on hover, check this checkbox called hover and when you hover, you can see the style here, a hover text decoration underline. So this is how hover works. In i6 and below, Hover used to work only with links, but in newer browsers, it works on any element. Let's see how. For example, we have one span and span don't have href, but we still can apply HTTP something dot com. Let's see. So right now, no hover is there, but we can still write down like span hover and let's see. So as you can see, the, the color is changed and text decoration is also applied. You can write down one more property cursor pointer but this is not standard way for anchor tag for href so as you can see it's working on span as well it is working on span href as well but normally we use anchor tag for href right so it works on any element this can be particularly useful for things like drop down menus in which you can wait for the hover of a parent list item and then reveal the next level of the nested menu. So that's all for this video. See you next time. Please subscribe my channel. Thank you.